let's take a retirement of partner today so let's see um the basic things about the retirement of a partner like uh, first of all i would like to take up the new profit sharing ratio and the gaining ratio like we did in admission admission whenever a new partner is admitted normally the existing partners sacrifice for the new partners but here in the case of retirement whenever a partner retires then the remaining partners always gain in some of the cases they may sacrifice also but majority of the cases it will be a gaining ratio for the old partners so let's first of all see how to calculate this gaining ratio so i'll take up a few questions to show you how to uh, calculate this gaining ratio and the new profit sharing ratio in the case of retirement right okay i'll take up a question here amit suresh and chetna are sharing profits and losses in the ratio of 5 is to 3 is to 2 right okay now calculate the new ratio if i'll put different cases here amit retires right suresh retires <clears throat> chetna retires okay now if amit is retiring in this case what we do is see the ratio is 5 is to 3 is to 2 right now this is the existing ratio so if the first partner that is amit he retires his share is this 5 so i will leave out that and this is 3 is to 2 right that means when amit retires then the remaining partner that is suresh and chetna will share profits and losses in the ratio of 3 is to 2 right if suresh retires in that case it will be 5 is to 2 that 3 will be gone right and if chetna retires it's going to be 5 is to 3 between the remaining partners now if i want to find out the gaining ratio this will be for suresh it will be the old ratio is 3 by 10 and the new ratio is 3 by 5 so it will be the new ratio minus the old ratio right that will be equal to then here and 3 to the 6 6 minus 3 3 3 by 10 and for the other partner it will be 3/5 new ratio is 2 by 5 minus the old ratio is 2 by 10 so this will be 4 minus 2 divided by 10 right that comes to 
टू बाई टेन राइट डिवाइडेड बाई डिवाइडेड बाई टेन विच इज इक्वल टू टू बाई टेन राइट सेम वे यू विल कैलकुलेट हियर सो हियर वेन आई वॉन्ट टू कैलकुलेट द गेनिंग रेशियो दिस इज इक्वल टू द न्यू रेशियो माइनस द ओल्ड रेशियो ओके नाउ आई टेक अ वन मोर क्वेश्चन A, B and C are sharing profits in the ratio of फोर is to फाइव is to सिक्स okay? C retires and his share is taken by A and B equally. Okay, now let's see how to do this. Now in this case, C's share is equal to six upon fifteen, right? So this six upon fifteen will be divided into two parts, and it is given here that C retires and his share is taken by A and B equally, right? So if six by fifteen. Is shared equally. It is six by fifteen into one by two, right? So that comes to six divided by thirty, or you can put it as three divided by fifteen. So this six by fifteen is divided into two equal shares of three by fifteen, right? Okay. So now A's new share. Will be equal to the earlier share was four upon fifteen plus they are gaining this much three by fifteen right okay hmm. so that becomes seven upon fifteen and B's new share is equal to five divided by fifteen plus three divided by fifteen. So this becomes eight divided by fifteen, right? So their new ratio will be equal to seven is to eight, okay? And their gaining ratio is equal. It's three by fifteen is to three by fifteen, so it becomes three is to three. That is one is to one, right? Okay. Hmm? gaining ratio is equal in this case that is 1 is to 1 okay okay one more type of question in this x y and z share profits in the proportion Three by eight, one by two, and one by eight, respectively, right? X retires and surrenders two third of her share in favor of. Y and the remaining in favor of Z, right? Now you have to calculate the new ratio and the gaining ratio for Y and Z, right? Okay. Now let's see.
x is retiring here so what is x share x share is 3 by 8 now it is given that x surrenders 2 by third of her share in favor of y right so 2 by 3 2 by 3 off that means 2 by 3 into 3 by 8 hmm, that will be equal to Two by eight, fine. Now this two by eight of x share is given to y, right? Okay. Now what is the remaining? They are saying, and the remaining is given to remaining to z. So remaining means total is total uh, share is one, right? not 1 here her share is 3 upon 8 so remaining means 3 by 8 minus 2 by 8 that will be equal to 1 upon 8 so 1 upon 8 is given to z right so now see the gaining ratio is what they get gaining ratio of y and z Gaining ratio means what they are getting from this retiring partner. So, here you can see x is getting this 2 by 8 and y is getting, sorry, y is getting 2 by 8 and z is getting 1 by 8. So, this ratio is 2 is to 1. This is the gaining ratio. Okay. Now, you have the gaining ratio, you have the old ratio. You have to calculate the new ratio. Okay, now let's calculate the new ratio here. Okay, new ratio for y will be equal to the old ratio plus the gaining ratio that is 2 upon 8. So, the old ratio in this case was how much? 1 by 2. 1 by 2 plus 2 by 8 is equal to. Eight here. Okay, so here it becomes four plus two. Four plus two. This is equal to six upon eight. Right. Now, the new ratio for Z that is equal to the old ratio plus one by eight. Okay. So, old ratio for z is 1 upon 8 and the gaining ratio is also 1 upon 8. So, this becomes 2 upon 8, right. So, the new ratio will be equal to 6 is to 2, sorry, 6 is to 2 which is equal to 3 is to 1, right. Okay, now one more question. I'll put it here. L, M, and N share profits in the ratio of. 1 by 3 is to 1 by 9 is to 1 by there is one more partner L, M, N and O right ok share profits in the ratio 1 by 3 is to 1 by 9 is to 1 by 3 is to 1 by 6 ok now O retires and other partners decide to 
share the future profits equally you have to find the gaining ratio in this question okay now they have given that the new ratio is equal right okay so that means it is 1 is to 1 is to 1 that is 1 by 3 1 by 3 1 by 3 okay hmm. now you have to find the gaining ratio gaining ratio is new minus old right so i'll gaining ratio for l will be equal to 1 by 3 minus 1 by 3 that is equal to 0 right so l is neither gaining nor losing sacrificing i write now the second partner m it is 1 by 3 minus 1 by 9 okay so that is equal to 2 by 9 and n it's again 1 by 3 minus 1 by 3 which is again equal to 0 so he is again neither gaining nor sacrificing so in this question only m is gaining by 2 by 9 right so you can have questions like this also where uh, some of the partners are not affected when a partner retires and there can be cases where a partner sacrifices also maybe one partner gains and the other partner is sacrificing right okay but majority of the cases it will be a gaining ratio so in questions of retirement you are supposed to find out the gaining ratio and the new ratio for uh, distribution of goodwill and all these things right okay so with that i come to the end of this session on retirement of partner uh, we'll be taking up treatment of goodwill in our next session bye